starting with the positive, one of the goals tonight was to get a good start, a fast start, and you accomplished that. Anything that this team did differently to get out and get running and get that pace going? Uh, no, not necessarily. I mean, we played our game. Uh, obviously, we started a different lineup, you know, trying to match their size and uh, just get out and run. Like, that's pretty much been our best offense, you know, try to get in transition, get easy buckets. Uh, so, no, we definitely did a good job of starting the game off. And then you led the entire second half up until the very end. What would you change? What would you take back in those final seconds? Oh, uh, we just got to get stops, you know. Uh, got a crunch time, you got to lock in. And obviously they did a good job of, you know, executing down the stretch. Um, Jackson at the floor, he did a lot of really good things tonight. What did you like about his game out there, being with him, playing with him? Uh, just being aggressive, you know, flashing, looking for his floater, um, running the floor, um, talking defensively. Um, you know, we ask a lot out of him. Um, and he brings it every night. So um, I told him after the game, you know, way to play because he, he played extremely well. And as far as the three ball as a team, that perimeter shooting just isn't, isn't falling right now. Is there something you can do to get that ball going in, or is it just a slump that you have to keep working your way out of? Just keep shooting. Uh, that's all we can do. Uh, it'll fall. We believe in it. We work on it. Uh, so we're definitely going to keep shooting all right, we can move to Zoom, please. Hey, Devontae, uh, Jackson was just talking a little bit of how his, his role offensively was different tonight than, you know, when he's playing at the center. And he said, you know, of course, he's taking the occasional jump shot, but he's kind of cutting in from the weak side and being opportunistic. Just how do you see him, I guess, just fair in, in a little bit of a different offensive role tonight? Uh, yeah, uh, space in the floor. You know, usually he's at the five and he's setting most of the screens and, uh, things like that, but um, obviously he knows how to play off the ball, when to cut, and when to be in the dunker uh, to get those drop-off passes for, for dunks and stuff like that. So uh, he did a good job of reading the defense and just being in the right spots. Hey, Devontae, hope you're doing well. What did you learn as a team playing without Brandon on the floor? And from tonight's game, how important is to maintain that 48 minute effort to the next games? Uh, I mean, we've been playing with B.I. You know, he's been out a couple of games, so uh, we know when he's out, you know, we got to try to pick up our pace, um, you know, move the ball, share the ball. Uh, same thing we, you know, normally do when he's out there, but, you know, with a little bit more pace to it. Um, I forgot that second question you asked, though. So. It's about what would you like to maintain from tonight's 48-minute effort? Uh, just continue to be aggressive. Um, obviously, you know, we led the entire game until the end, but uh, I just felt like everybody was playing with confidence, shooting the ball, uh, make or miss, you know. You got you to gotta play with confidence, and I think we did a good job of that. Thanks, Dad. Appreciate it. Thanks.